Well, we're back home. So what are we waiting for? We gotta get back in the hoopty barn. It's day 69. Who's ready to go see what kind of mischief we can get into? Well, hey everybody, it is old Big Mike. We are back home, back out here in the hoopty barn with the Blue Goose, the old 31 Plymouth, and it's a fairly nice day out there. I think we're just going to work with the shop doors open. I might put on a little fan out there or something to get some air moving around in here, but uh, we're going to get back to work on this, dude. I always love going on an adventure. I always love coming back home, too. So, anyway, let's get into it. So, last time... As far as I can recall, we were on our wiring here, and we got all this business kind of going on in here. And today, I believe, I'm going to work on getting the rest of this, all this mess, up here buttoned up. I'm going to go inside, and I'm going to try to... Get some clips put on up in there and stuff and get all this stuff up in the air so it's not just laying on the motor and all that stuff. I gotta um, put some extensions here from this. I'm gonna have to clip this and splice in some wire because there's no way that's gonna fit up there. So anyway. We got some splicing and dicing and all that stuff to do and get stuff up out of the way. And we're going to try and get these headlight buckets wired. And huh, It's going to be one of them days. going to be kind of slow going, but I'm just going to get in here and get busy and I'll come back and show you when I got some progress to show you. That was a heck of a day. I know I didn't record much, but I mean, there's not really much to record when you're doing this stuff. It's just a bunch of slow, piddly, messed up stuff. So, I figured I'd rather just show you the results. So, here we are. So, there's my back side of my headlights. See where I put these little rubber grommets in there. And run my wires through now I'm not I didn't wire these quite yet these are supposed to be my turn signals I'll have to get an amber light for them I'm not a hundred percent sold on them I think they look pretty good but I don't know I'm not a hundred percent sold on them yet so I'm gonna wait till I go to the junkyard before I completely do that but at least these are wired up for the modern headlights um, Let's see, I got my wiring here, I got my voltage regulator on, and my little vacuum block here, my ground strap from my motor to my firewall, got my other wiring kind of put together and put up there, and you're really going to love this on the other side. I had to take the main uh, I guess the main harness whatever you call that block there I took that back out and I took the piece of steel that it was on yeah I put it back through that and I put it there I put some steel on the other side of it and yeah I just sprayed that sucker with spray foam I'm gonna let it do its thing and then I'll cut off all the excess. And then I'll work on building this panel. After all that's set up, I'm gonna put all this wire in a panel over here on the side. Out of the way. Got a little bit pooched out here. Eh, it's a hoopty. That was a long freaking day. I know it was just like a few minutes for y'all, but 
a long dang day for me. So, anywho, that's what we got done on day 69. So, appreciate y'all coming along. Do me a favor, if you ain't subscribed, you know, hit that subscribe button. Hit that thumbs up or that thumbs down if you don't think I'm doing good. And uh, leave a comment. Hit that notification bell so you know when the next video comes out, which will be tomorrow. I'm back, I promise, for day 68. And uh, I reckon, till next time, you know the drill. If y'all keep watching, I'll keep working.